So hello guys and welcome back to this new episode Suji here as usual. Before I start this one I wanted to quickly ask you one thing and to ask this question actually I'm gonna need to shamelessly plug in my Twitter. The link is in the description if you guys want to follow me but the question actually is about Twitter. So for those that follow me on Twitter you know that occasionally I post a picture of a drop or something like that I get or complete on because I like posting those on the Twitter and but the thing is the Recently, as I've been getting, you know, nice high level drops or whatever, I didn't post them on Twitter because I feel like it would be a spoiler for those that watch my video. So the question is for those people that follow me on Twitter, do you guys feel like I should post, like I can post them on Twitter or do you guys prefer not to see them on there? Because, you know, I guess it spoils the episode, but you still get a reaction from the drop as well. And I guess you can look forward to whatever I got in that, you know, picture to see in the next episode. So please let me know in the comments below what do you think about that. And now that we are done with the talking part, I guess, there we go for a first level of the episode as well. So 79 fishing coming in. I decided to go AFK some Karam ones because I'm still editing the previous episode. Zena is for life, man. And uh, yeah, anyway, so let me know what you think about that because I honestly just love posting achievements on my Twitter. And if you don't follow me already, feel free to follow me on Twitter. So yeah, that's what all that I wanted to say. And enjoy the rest of the episode now, guys. Okay, I don't know how, but somehow I forced myself to do some room crafting and this should be the first level. There we go. 71 room crafting coming in, you guys, so six more to go, I guess. But uh, yeah, struggling hard to do one level a day, so I will at least try to do one level an episode. How about that? Okay, so not sure how this happened, but I stayed for another level. This is amazing, 72 rune crafting coming in and nothing new at another two levels in a row, nothing new. But yeah, don't think I will actually stay up until 73 because I got bored a bit already. So probably just gonna go back to stay here. And what the fuck is with my phone interrupting my clips all the time? Well, look at this. So I got an abyssal demon task and I think I did like not more than 10 kills and we got ourselves whip number three, I believe. Yeah, I have one equipped and I have one as my abyssal tentacle. So this will win most likely go towards the abyssal tentacle charges because those will get used up pretty quickly once I start doing God Wars and other bosses that require me to use that whip, I guess. Another hard clue coming in this time from uh, Gargoyles. So let's see. Armadale page three. Uh... You know what, we're next to the bank, let's check. Please? Yeah, of course not, so I need Armadale page uh, one. Okay, oh man, my RNG is on point lately, isn't it? Another abyssal whip coming in, you guys, so this is like two tasks since my, since the abyssal task, I guess, that I got previous one, and uh, yeah, so far, one task a whip past three tasks, I believe, so yeah, whip number four. Well, this won't be another whip drop, but in fact, look at this lovely thing, another level 90 skill coming in, you guys. So I've been training Slayer, or I've been alking all my drops while training Slayer, so it works out, uh, works out just fine. I actually already alked all my air battle stabs that I made, and I ended up alking all the rune items as well, because I had quite a lot of them, you know, from the drops and whatnot. I still have really nice amount of dragon items that I can elk for like 10 mil GP, but I'm not sure if I do want to elk them because you know, most of these items are like dragon mad helms and dragon holbergs from Zoldra and stuff like that. So yeah, I guess I'll think about that for now. But other than that, this is like, what, number 12, I believe, skill 90 plus. So this is actually really nice. Okay guys, so you must know what this means, right? I am about to get myself the 100 Lova Kench favor. I'm not sure when it's going to happen, so I'm just gonna start recording now. But anyways, this is my last favor as well. So after I do finish this one, I will be able to un uh, lock it down, I guess, and finally uh, complete the Architecture Alliance mini quest. So, oh yeah, there we go, actually. So uh, yeah. I can now complete the mini quest as well. I just need to find this guy right here to lock in my favor. But other than that, 
100% means as well that I can wait where is it view, view tasks list yes and yeah I can now make or yeah make tier 5 she's an equipment but I believe that the quickest way to get the armor is actually to go kill guards for it so that's what I will do as well and the last thing that I want to come show you guys I guess is yeah 96 lizardman task I have so obviously probably not going to get the dragon warhammer in that amount but I never even killed those before so that's going to be a solid start but for now let's go ahead and find that NPC and lock our down favor okay and there we go there is the guy that should lock in my favor right space bar as usual of course um should yeah there we go should be done i guess now let's grab ourselves a house teleport so we can you know spawn outside the Koran statue or whatever okay so i'm not sure how this is done but there is the mini quest now i've signed up an architect from each five houses of Quran. i should see if they're ready to build the statue okay so i believe the first one was this one so i should be able to finish Hey, there we go, a cutscene. I must be doing something right, I guess. Hey, there we go. Why is there no pop-up? They should really do it like the quest kind of pop-up for mini quests. But anyways, nice. So that is done. All favors are 100% and locked in now. So now let's go ahead and get ourselves the Shazian armor, I guess. Okay, so with this one dead, I guess, there we go for the last... Tier 5 outfit piece and I now have full Shazian armor, right? That's how it's called. Okay, and there we go for the Lizardman task completed. Sadly, you can't really kill them off task here because it would be nice. I would probably probably do some more kills, but yeah, 100 KC almost. I had was like, what, 96, I believe. Uh, honestly, did not expect to get the Dragon Warhammer in that amount because the drop rate is 1 in 5k so this is going to take a while honestly I'm not gonna lie and that's just in case I get it in the drop rate but usually people go way drier than that so uh yeah anyways it was nice I guess to try them out for the first time but other than that first task New task is Greater Demons. Should I go try Zami? Okay guys, so doing just some agility since I am looking up the Zami setups that I could possibly use because I am most likely going to be going Zami. And because of that, of course, a 78 agility coming in. So I have what, like 140, right? I don't remember what the amount I got for Greater Demons, but I should get at least 70 plus Zami KC. So probably going to get a spear or something in that kc so hopefully i will see you guys from uh yeah zami room oh my fucking god you're kidding me <laughs> no fucking way free kc free kc staff of the dead oh my god oh man I wish it was a Zami spear, but I'm obviously not gonna complain about this shit. Holy crap! Just taking another small break from Zami to get this lovely level. 88 farming coming in, you guys. Holy shit! I can't believe I'm 88 already, but uh, yeah, Zami-wise, I believe I am at like... Oh, we can actually check. Uh, 16kc. Only 6... Dude, this shit is so slow, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I do from 2 to 4 kills a trip, which is, well, as I said, slow AF, and I have like 110 more to go, so this task will most likely take me an entire day tomorrow, if not more, so, well, I guess this episode won't be concluded until I finish off the task for sure. Oh, and also, since we are talking levels, I guess, 1998 total. Two more levels, so 2k, man, this is... This is going to be nice. Okay, so my internet is being a little bit annoying this uh, evening, so I decided to stay and train some more agility. And because of that, of course, another agility level coming in, 79 agility. And yes, this is such a good shortcut as well, because 
and up until now I have been wasting my summer pies for this whenever I had that clue in the east part of Kazari jungle or whatever I guess I don't need that anymore and anyways need to get at least one more agility level sooner rather than later because 80 agility is the level required for the shortcut to get to black demons you know in Teverly which I will be using a lot once I get another hellhounds task I guess you know so I can go to servers but other than that I think I'm gonna go ahead and try my internet is it still lagging if not I feel like it's time to go back to Zami oh my fucking god no way <laughs> that's why you do four kill trips boys oh my god and I'm actually testing out the what is it uh, called uh, Mage pre method or whatever, and holy shit! 28 KC, two items. My luck is beyond the roof. Like it's 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 going through the roof, man. Oh my god! Holy shit! I'm speechless, guys. I need one more. Give me one more spear, and I will be done with Zami for now. I think I'm gonna leave this as a spear because I wanna do corp, and in case I wanna do corp, and what is it? That you need spear for again. Man, I just, uh, it doesn't matter. I need one more so I can make a hasta so I can, uh, so I have hasta for raids and uh, other stuff. I don't remember what it's used for now, but anyways, second Zami item, guys. Zami spear. Now look at that. First God Sword shard coming in, you guys. God Sword shard 2. So yeah, it's gonna take a while until we actually complete one but still 52 kc so far first shot coming in anyway so i think i will actually conclude this episode on this note you guys because it's been like five days since i uploaded and i feel like it's been a while and i kind of want to go do some other stuff now i know i only did 50 free kills of krill but Honestly, it took me so long. You guys have no idea because I honestly get from two to five, uh, two, from two to four kills every trip, and most likely just two or three. So it takes a while, honestly. You know when you need to get KC every two fucking kills. So, uh, but yeah, I definitely gonna do some more in the future. But for now, I mean, I did get the Zami spear, which is the most important thing. Of course, the staff of the dead is nice as well, but it's not really useful for anything. But this one, I will most likely uh, turn it into the Hasta and use it because honestly, the only place that you actually use Zami spear, I believe, is Corp, and I'm not doing Corp right now because I don't have Dragon Warhammer or anything like that. I will definitely do it in the future and hopefully by then I will get back to Zami and get myself another spear. So I am using the, uh, I'm changing this one to Hasta so I have it uh, for the stuff that it is actually useful like raids. Yeah, I mean I just realized, you know, when I was doing this, uh, some of the previous trips that Hasta is used for raids and is one of the requirements for that, so I should really focus on getting Dragon Warhammer next. So if I can do that, I would be pretty much set for raids. So that's why, where my focus, what, that's where I want to put my focus on right now. And anyways, in the next episode, actually, I will be doing some construction at the beginning, most likely, because let me show you guys. I did spend some time, I elked all the drops as I mentioned earlier in the episode, I had 25 mil cash and as you guys can see I only had 15 mil left, that's because I turned all my T clocks into planks and there we go, that is 12k oak planks and 19k T planks, I don't know the total XP, amount of XP in that but that is 88 construction right here and I can still claim my miscellaneous for more T clocks, but anyways, I will get myself 85, I believe, construction, and I will boost to upgrade my pool in my house because I do have those anti venoms, and also upgrade my jewelry box to the best one. So that is the plan for now. After that, probably Lizardman Shaman for Dragon Warhammer. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to uh, see you guys in the next episode. Peace and bye.